Inside the labyrinth of political maneuvering, a newly uncovered scheme sheds light on the lengths to which Democratic allies of Joe Biden went to secure his RE election amidst growing voter discontent and concerns over his health. The strategy akin to spy novel tactics included unprecedented steps such as bird-dogging congressional supporters of third-party candidates and deploying street performers to harass key opposition figures in their private lives. Central to this strategy was targeting Nancy Jacobson, the founder of No Labels, a group that posed a significant electoral threat by seeking to introduce a third-party candidate. Disturbingly, the plan involved clowns and musicians creating chaos outside her home, a tactic designed to intimidate and distract. This aggressive campaign, detailed in court documents, included plans to embarrass political adversaries publicly and inundate their lives with nuisances, hoping to derail their efforts at diversifying the presidential race. These revelations highlight a sinister side of political strategy, where boundaries of decency and legality blur in the high-stakes game of power. The disclosure of these documents now poses serious questions about the ethical compass of Biden's campaign and its allies, as they navigated the complex and often murky waters of political warfare. As the public and political pundits alike scrutinize these actions, the true impact on democratic integrity and public trust remains to be seen.